So um, we'll just read it now. It says, Moss, I'm here for a reality check for you. My friend, I believe um, your ego has run off, uh, run off the tracks, run off the train, run this train off its tracks. Uh, I think you are, uh, you are burnt out, need a long vacation to examine this whole thing. Shortening the monthly program, eliminating the extras we loved, and doubling price uh, for them, and now limiting IGHs to 11 exclusive uh, elitists, 300 fucking dollars, paying their wealthy, paying wealthy students. Uh, are you fucking kidding? You brag you're almost, uh, you brag you're almost a billionaire. I do. Hmm. While many of you of your long-term dedicated lawyer students cannot even afford this anymore, um, many newer folks are asking uh, me what has happened to you. You say uh, XI is for the world. Uh, it's turning into an exclusive elitist club when only the wealthy can join. Uh, those students who have worked so damn hard under your guidance uh, for years are now so let down. Those who have not yet come into financial abundance are left out. Um, is that what you want? Uh, check that huge ego of yours. Uh, broke is it's straining. Mm, this beautiful thing. Uh, that Instagram post today was an over-the-top ego rant. Uh, we question the purity of it, uh, of what this is now, reality check time. Uh, ever since the crystal skull uh, event, you appear to have been hijacked, not elevated. Uh, please, for yourself and for for us, uh, reevaluate yourself and uh, what this is. It feels kind of dark now. <clears throat> Remember, many of us uh, see the same thing that you do and can even do what a lot of you do. Uh, we are all here as equals, or so I thought. Uh, bring this back on track. Mouse, please, and don't read me uh, and deflect it by saying this is my distortion. Uh, you yourself have said, um, you yourself have said I am centered and clear spiritually. Uh, I say that these things to help you and to organization and every student trying to follow you through your ego maze. Um, listen for once. XI is not yours. Uh, it's here for all uh, of us. True. Uh, it's absolutely true. Uh, again, um, sure. So there's a lot of ways, you know, we can look at that, uh, which is really cool. I'm glad you brought that out. Um, again, uh, um, I don't, I don't ever claim I said I was a billionaire. So that's one thing. I'm far from it, by the way. Um, especially with all the taxes I pay and so on. But uh, anyway. Well, outside of that, so that's an error there. As far as being clear, uh, even me uh, is, is not as clear. Okay, So if you're learning from me, you just obviously wouldn't be as clear as I would be. Right? Otherwise, I'd be learning from you, although I learn from all of you and everything and everyone. So that's where that is. So if you think you're completely clear, well, uh, you're not. So uh, an, another thing is that, you know, price... You know, we do a lot of free, we do a t shitload of free sessions on there, okay? Uh, a ton of free stuff uh, that you can take advantage of, uh, and we'll, we'll do more. So it's not about the elitists or anything like that, but, you know, what we found out through, you know, working on hundreds of thousands of people to reach the masses, you know, are you going to, are you going to work with, say, higher level influencers where they can, they can say, say I work with a CEO level, okay? Work with a CEO level. He's got 10,000 employees. That, that CEO will transform 10,000 people without me uh, because his essence will change the whole dynamics, the whole, the whole manufacturing process, the whole uh, products or services that he or she has to the world. So his pure essence will, will flourish and help through the whole world. Okay? This is not about money. This is not about ego. This is, this is about a fucking time factor, guys. Okay? I just don't have time 
to say coddle people or you know or uh, especially if you've been doing XI for years you know kick yourself in the ass or do something and get out there uh, and work your ass off that's what I do right so again if I spend time with one individual that can only help himself what would you do if I spent one person take take an hour of time okay uh, and work on one individual and he, and they help themselves or I could spend the same amount of time okay same amount of money uh, and, and, and you know these people are say well I'll talk about the money later um, th these people right this person knows again like 500 people, 10,000 people, they influence a t shitload of people out there. They've got success mechanisms already built in. So how many people can I shift in one hour compared to one person or compared to uh, some guy who knows 500 to 10,000 or 20,000 people? Okay? It's all logistics. It's all math. It's got nothing to do with ego or anything like that. It's just math. Look at nature. Okay? Look at nature. Look at the way nature does it. This is pure XI. Okay? Those individuals who think I'm, uh, I've got that ego state, uh, and define ego, by the way. You have the abilities. If you have it uh, and you know uh, you're good, just like Michael Jordan, right? Uh, he was the best basketball player. Is that ego or is that just telling you statistically that he's the best basketball player? Now, how he got there by maybe... Uh, bullying people and so on, that's not the coolest thing uh, from what I've heard or just reading him um, now that I read him. Shit. Uh, anyway, uh, forget that. I'm not going to read Michael Jordan. But uh, that's not an ego state. It just is. It's just a statistics. Right? So all those individuals, this isn't about spirituality. Guys. This is about transform. I'm here to transform the world. Okay? I love you all. But I will not wait for you. I don't wait for my kids. That's why they're damn good kids. And they're on, on, on point. They are on point. I treat you guys, let's say, a lot more, and I'm not a jerk or anything as a father, but I demand a hell of a lot out of my kids than I do my clients because I know they can take it. Okay? So... If you wanted me to treat you like my kids, you guys would be a lot, you'd move a lot faster, but then you'd go, whoa, Moss is egotistical or Moss is a jerk and so on like that because you weren't raised like that. And I'm not saying you were raised wrong, but what the hell, you were raised wrong, right? You, you, you know, you blame your parents, you blame government, you blame society, you blame God, you blame the religions. Fuck, just turn around, just pinpoint yourself, Look at yourself in the mirror. Look at all the shit that you've got inside you and get all that stuff out of you. And I'm saying this because uh, I love you all. I'm not saying because I'm pissed or uh, egotistical or anything like that. That's what I had to do, guys. That's what I had to do myself. Nobody was there to tell me. I had to figure this damn thing out myself. Right? As far as today's post... Um, not exactly sure which one you meant the are you ready for the opportunities or the one um I posted two on there the one that uh I said um believe or I or some guy and this is uh, let me tell you the story of the hand so if you go to Instagram or Facebook um there's a guy's hand so this was from project knowledge okay, this was from project knowledge and the guy ridicules people who have, you know, he's like an, he literally like an anti, uh, what is this, conspiracy theorist, right? He knocks on conspiracy theorists and, you know, everything that's true or not true, whatever like that, right? So he's making fun of, hey, read my palm and all this. So, so I read his palm for him. Simple as that. There's, there's no fucking ego in it. Uh, it just basically says, I don't need, and I'll just read this. I hope this is the one. Uh, the guy basically says, what does my destiny tell of me? You know, just making it a joke because that's his, um, uh, that's his uh, I guess, post. Uh, and he's got his palms out, right? Uh, and so what I wrote is, I don't need your palms or, or anything else to, to read you. 
uh, I don't I didn't don't need to know I don't need to I don't need your name a picture crystal balls tea leaves I don't need AI or algorithms like what Google Facebook CIA FBI use I don't need to track you or have you fill out forms I don't need you to take medical samples or test uh, I don't need I don't need to know you uh, you can even be dead uh, I don't use intuition psychic abilities uh, read your aura your, your horoscope I I can't analyze you by uh, I can analyze you by your frequency signature. Here's your analysis, and I read them. If that's an ego ploy, I'm not exactly sure what ego ploy is. I can do all of those, and there's no ego in it. The ego is in discrepancies, insecurities of other people who are short in something or everything, and then they look at people who are strong. And uh, and you know, have created something, have worked their ass off. Yes, there's ego uh, that those individuals who've worked their say they work their ass off, and now their definition of say success is is again a distortion of what they have accumulated. They haven't in, in, enhanced themselves. Yes, that's an ego. That's not me. So I don't know where you got the ego part. Uh, I do have a big big ego. To transform somebody the way I do, you would have to fucking believe in yourself. I wave my hand and people change. If you were in another world, people would fucking go crazy. If, if this was 20 years ago, they'd put me in jail for witchcraft and all that stuff. People around me change. That's not ego. It's just something that happens. I can't even figure it out. I try my best. And my abilities are getting more powerful. Again, that's not ego. I'm just telling you they're getting more powerful. You're telling me that I'm getting more powerful. I'm just stabilizing it. Many of you get into even the lower frequencies and you get destabilized. And this is an ego ploy. I'm just telling you at the lower frequencies, you guys get fucked up. What do you think? Where do you think I am? Okay. And again, that's not an ego. It's just statistics. Obviously, I'm at a higher frequency than all of you. Otherwise, I'd be learning from one of you all. But I'm not. Right? At the higher frequencies, you have to stabilize yourself. These frequencies don't fucking care who you are what burdens you came from, what hurts you're licking or those wounds or whatever the hell it is. It just doesn't care. It'll destroy you, just like you go out into the jungle. It doesn't care if you had a bad day, a good day. You stub your feet, whatever happens. You're lying down, you're, you're thirsty, you're hungry. Nobody cares. Some animal is just going to eat your ass and you're dead. You're gone. Simple as that. That's the law of nature. It's a lot worse on the spiritual side. It's a lot worse. You have a ton more, say, frequencies that destroy you. Those are just at the crust. Some of the things that I say, yes, I do have abilities to shift and transform uh, the world. It's been proven. So, again, it's not an ego state. It's just something that is. Right? If somebody wins, you know, 12 races, say, in a race car or table tennis or tennis or whatever, and they go, hey, I've won 12 races. It's not an ego state. It's just something statistically. Right? So, as far as money goes, you know, you know Tony Robbins... He fucking charges, what is it, a million dollars for three hours. I've been to his sessions. He charges $5,000 for, uh, what is it on, UPW? What is it called? What's it, what does it say? Unleash your power within. It's like four to 6000 depending on where you're sitting. He does interventions. He takes... Two, I've been there, guys. He takes two hours to talk things through and do whatever. Two hours. And he still doesn't get to the root of the problem. 
I've been in that audience. As soon as that person stands up, I know exactly what the hell's wrong with that person. Tony doesn't even get near him, near that. His trainers, they charge thousands of dollars. Your psychologist that you go to, three, four hundred dollars for what, every half hour. For decades you're going there. How much does that cost you? You go to you go to a doctor, like you get a bill for five thousand dollars. What the hell do they do? They didn't even help you. That's just like preliminaries. You go to some I don't know, marketing individual. They'll charge you thousands. And what do you get? Nothing. So in comparison, still, those people, those individuals, they actually laugh. Those, those individuals who run, say, the, the motivation circuits. And I've got ton, a ton of people who, who are coming on to XI. They've used Tony Robbins, Joe Dispenza, um, Grant Cardone, and all, you know, all those big names. And they charge a hell of a lot more per hour than I do. And you don't get anything. It's just more, yeah, you go to the next stage. You, if you buy our next stage, we'll help you. And then you're in that next stage. And then you go to the next stage. Yeah, well, you just buy the next stage. And then that's where you get the real answers. So cost comparison. You change in 18 days. It's not that we shortened it. Just that many of you couldn't handle the 21 days. Straight out. The foundational class or the essential class now is literally the accelerated class. The accelerated is a higher version. Many people get messed up. You don't read the, de you don't read the emails that they get. We're trying to put a support system for you guys. Right, with people that I can actually trust to help you because I obviously I'm not there all the time. Right? And what I do, I'm just like a surgeon. And again, I've told you this before. I'm not here to tell you all the things that's right with you. You don't pay me for that. Right? Especially if money is tight for you. You just don't pay me for that. I get to the point. If you want somebody to tell you all those things are right, guys, all those things are right, go get a coach for yourself. Uh, some go get some cheerleaders for you, but you don't go to a doctor and go, "Hey, what's right with me?" They don't do that. I'm here to know exactly what's wrong with you, just surgically, however you want to call it, just remove it for you, so you can get on with your life. It's called efficiency. High performance consciousness is about efficiency. Okay? That's true caring, by the way. It's true caring. Everything else is just bullshit. It's just people coddling you uh, so you can stay weak. Straight out. They don't tell you what you need. So, again, money-wise, for the money, there's, you know, there's people that actually, they're students of mine that actually charge more than what I do. And they're not even close what I do. Not even close. So think of it. There's a ton of people, again, in that circuit, the self-improvement circuit. They come to me and, you know, people get raving reviews, right? They, they transform, they shift. They come to their friends who, you know, have higher incomes. And they, those people are used to paying or, you know, paying like I don't know, three. So, so the, uh, this is a real story, okay? Um, again, many students come, uh, you know, they get changes. They'll, uh, I'll give you one story. This one guy, super, super like in the, you know, super elite class, um, you know, levels as far as money and connections and so on like that. You know, he's those famous performers and all that. Um, and he's talking about me. I was life changed because he's that person's ass. I was like, how the hell did he get you know off addictions, off drugs, all that stuff? It's like, how did you do it? Because they've gone through alcoholics and all that stuff it hasn't worked out. So in what two, two, three months of the twenty-one days, 
after spending what tens, twenty, thirty, forty thousand on all the shit that they've gone through, still hasn't worked out in comparison? To write that, just that alone right, would would be enough. But let me tell you the rest of the story. So the guy looks at my program, it's like you can do all that. Right? He goes, Yeah, in the eighteen days. You know, before it was the twenty one days. You can do all that in the twenty one days. It's like, yeah. So the guy like starts to sign up and he goes, but it's only, I don't even know how much we charge. I, I'm, that's not my department, by the way. Um, um, and he, the guy looks, it's like, I'm not signing up. And the, and the person that's changed is like, well, why not? I, I, you know, I just told you, you know, what's happened to me and you've seen what's happened to me. He goes, yeah, but for something like that, it doesn't look real to me because of the price is so low. He was expecting to pay like three, four thousand dollars a month. So, so there's tons of and these these people are like influencers. So if you want to play and change the world at that level, you have to play and change that world, right? And again, that's why. Again, it's open for everybody. I is I didn't develop it. Uh, again, I, I put it all together nice and handy for all of you so you don't have to go through the process uh, yourself. Uh, for the people who can't afford it, there's a ton of free stuff that we still do. Uh, at my frequencies, the, the, what I generate, and again, it's not an ego state. It just, it just is. Okay? Uh, I can change. I can get rid of dead grandmothers. I mean, how many dead grandmothers can I remove? It gets boring for me, guys. To read the same thing over and over again. Okay? It's like, yes, you've got a dead grandmother. You hang. Yes, you've got this, 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 this. I can do that with both, I had both hemispheres of my brain tied behind my back. It literally is that simple. And I'm not saying in an, in an ego state. I just can. Okay? So I need to go ascend higher. And that's why whole business restructuring so I can work on people who, say, want to bring in the possibilities of what could be. I don't want to fix people. I don't want to focus in on fixing people. That should just be like, say, a session, a group session, a personal development, personal optimization session, a deprogramming session. You don't need to spend. That's why we did it. You don't need to spend whatever you spent on an IGA to get your dead grandmother out of you. You can do that to optimize yourself. Be, push your potential. You get a fucking mentor. And they'll charge you thousands of dollars for what I charge in comparison. A high-level mentor. And you won't even get near, not even a smidgen of uh, what you do with me. So, I've actually made it cheaper for you guys. I do that at a group level so more people can attend and get the same benefit that you would have an IGH on your own. Simple as that, guys. So it's efficiency, efficiency, efficiency equals love. I know that sounds strange. For many of you, love is about burden. You have to burden yourself to take care of the people, to take care of the world. How well has that worked out for you all? How well has that worked out for the world? How well did that work out for Mother Teresa? Is that her name, Mother Teresa? Yeah. It didn't. I, no offense, this is an ego state. I tapped into Mother Teresa. She was still... I'm not making it up... She was still rolling around, let's say, in her grave going, I'm not good enough. I haven't helped enough people to feel good about going into heaven. And that was a long, long time ago. Again, that's not an ego state. It's just something that I read. Now, I could be totally off on it. I could be totally, I could be drunk, high or whatever at the time. Okay? But when I read her, that's what I saw. I helped her cross over properly. And that's another thing, guys. All the people that just naturally come to me, whether they're dead 
or people that I just randomly work on or people that just come to me around at the, say, I go shopping. You know how many people I just randomly just work on? They just, like, follow me around the grocery store. There's a reason for that. I understand that. I work on them for free. I don't give them a bill. How many of you have I helped dead people cross over properly? I don't give you a bill for all that stuff. Again, do you guys want to go on this journey? It's tough. You can't handle it. Take a break. But I'm not waiting for you guys. The time is here. It's not me creating the time. It's a universal time. It changes. You take advantage of the opportunity or you're out. I realize that. I'm not going to be out because of, I'm not going to wait for anybody. I'll gladly help you along if you can help yourself. I'll show you the way. Push you to your best possible self. I can guarantee you that. But I will not wait for anybody. Neither should you. And you shouldn't expect anybody to wait for you either. So as we end, notice what you notice and then notice the details of what you're noticing. 